Boom. We're here with vlog number two. Lucifer Menace is in the building. You can call me Jay if you want. It's all right. Real name, but whatever. So, sitting here, let's cook some food. I had some footage of me cooking, but uh, forgot to turn on the mic, so can't use that footage. Um, nothing really much to do today. A lot of people don't know, but I have the connect to get crazy amounts of stuff on auctions for our company. Sometimes I do some arbitrage trading, trading, I mean, buying and selling. This right here, this stuff that these rich people are putting on their face, this thing's worth $3,000. Got it for $45, 45, that's it. I'm just trying to sell it. For some reason, the company doesn't want me to put it on eBay or anything, so I gotta find some way to sell it. So, and then this one right here, Dior 24K. This thing's worth $900, $45. 45 that's it that's it so i cooked some dinner for bubba you know she works a lot of hours so wait until she gets off and then uh we'll see uh right now i'm just uh on this little auction site and uh looking for some goodies something i could probably sell later on or some stuff that i might want for myself you have to live in Nevada in order to use this site. It's called Nellis Auctions. I just gave you a plug. But you have to be either in Arizona or Nevada. So if you're not in any of those, sorry. Come move to Las Vegas and come enjoy the plug. And while you're out here, hit me up. So I'll start this video off. I want you to subscribe, follow my crazy life, and give me a thumbs up. Helps out the video, helps it get seen, and it helps the brand out. You know, make sure to check out my clothing site too, menacedefinition.com. I'll put it on the screen somewhere. You know, the link will be in the description. And trust me right now, I'm giving 20% off on everything for the summer. So I suggest you check it out. All you gotta do is go on the site. If you don't wanna go through all the, the promotions, just leave your email at least. You don't gotta buy nothing. Leave your email. I'll keep you up to date with everything. I customize my own clothes. So you tell me something. Maybe 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 you want something. Comment below and tell me what you want. And I'll make it. I will make sure it's hot. It's hot. <laughs> but uh I'm gonna tune in. I'm gonna turn this camera back on when something cool happens. Okay? Mm -hmm. What's up, YouTube? And we're back, and uh, I'm about to take my anger management class. You know, because uh, I don't know. It's court ordered. I gotta take it. So, holla at you afterwards. I might play some World War Z on Xbox. I don't fuck with PS4. You motherfuckers and your free networks but nah I don't do that I'm on Xbox leave a comment below and maybe I'll leave my uh, I'll leave my name so holla at you I'm gonna do some cooking today and uh, make sure Bubba has something to eat when she gets back from a long day of working she works crazy hours so you might not see her too much in the vlog We might record some footage today. Uh, might record some footage today doing a music video or something. We keep postponing it because she works so much, but uh, maybe we'll do it today. Uh, you! I, 
I wish, I wish I did. I did in the shower finally. Let it all out. Oh my god, did you not in the shower? I'm I let it go down the drain. <laughs> hey. Hey there. What's, what are you doing? Are you sleeping? Are you sleeping, you cute little thing, you? Say hi. Say hi. On my hand. Give me some love. Give me some love. This is my baby. This is my baby trick. My baby. You dog, your daddy. You dog, your daddy. You dog, your daddy. You dog, your daddy. Only daddy knows how to rub you the right way, huh? My gosh, I had the scare of my life today. What'd you do? I got so scared. My probation officer came today. What she said? She said I need to pee for her, or else I will go back to lock up. She couldn't pee though. I got scared. I don't do stuff like that, you know. She thinks we're doing drugs. This is a drug-free house. Yeah, this is sober living, biatch. <laughs> don't do that shit. <laughs> drugs are bad, bitches. Drugs are bad, okay? Man, my face looks clear. This is a nice little color difference. Got the blue over here, the yellow here. Oh. Oh. At least your skin is clear. Yeah, it's getting clear. Not being in jail. Ew, uh, being in jail is so nasty and getting those jail acne. The jail acne, the nose. It's hard. With a bunch of dust. Yep, you see my nasty jail acne. Jail acne. I was really insulted. I was really insulted when her buddy was like, I don't have a job. I've been running like 24 hours, 13 hours, seven days a week since I've been out of lockup. It took me eight days to get a job. I really want my freedom. They're trying to hate on you. She's a hater because she's a dyke. They're both dykes. <laughs> that was funny. Fucking dykes. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, YouTube? What you want to say to them? I love you guys. I miss you. Miss them? I don't even know you. No, you never met my menaces. Nope. You're like not friends with me on Facebook. No, we're There's really like not. There's like thousands of people that will just like say what's up to you. My phone's ringing. I'm not answering it. I don't want to talk to nobody. I don't care what the f they want. Today I went to... Ooh, let me fix the camera. Today I went to therapy, and it was good. I liked it. I, I was anger management. He needs anger management. She said I need anger management. I found this digital camera. I want to start recording you now. Something I could feel. Then I'm gonna make my YouTube channel available for the fan of fans. They can see our daily life. Aliens, awesome. You guys see my menaces first. An alien? I lost a lot of menaces because I haven't been posting nothing. But I'm gonna promise them this and get them another vlog. Oh Wait. my gosh, my peel's ass was so fat, dude. It is. I never saw a booty so juicy looking. Not even in lockup. The girls look like. Yo, the girls look like disgusting. Like, it stink a lot down there. Like, a lot of them don't take a shower. Yeah, I bet. They just sit there and, like, not shower for days. 
I was like, ew. No wonder why I stink like that in the van. Shit, I, I, man, look, I go fucking, I go to jail. I, I don't take a shower for like a week. When I was in jail for a month, like I didn't take a shower for, I took a shower once. I think. Are you really recording that? Yeah, I don't care. Shit. No, he said his balls and his dick stung. When, yeah. I go, when I go to jail, I'm pretty much dead. I just lay in the bed. Show them your stomach. No. I Look mean, at his stomach. I be cooking for him, and he be cooking too. He's a big boy now. Yeah, you ain't eat your food either. I cooked. Yes, I did. I ate it. When? There's the whole plates in there. I did eat all of it. Oh. That was the first thing I wanted when I came home. I was hungry. Oh, and I started putting butter inside the coffee when you make it. Because it makes the caffeine, like it doesn't give you the, the, the jitters or anything. Boy, you be making me laugh sometimes. Okay, you can do whatever you want. Whatever you do, I still love you. I don't care. I love everything you do. I love everything that you do. I want, dude. They have Diablo for PS4. Yeah, they 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 redid Diablo. You Reaper. guys hear that? They redid Diablo too. Reaper, of it's coming out. I'm gonna download it. It's already on the Game Pass on uh, Xbox. Me. My PO wanted to know how long can I stay here for. Oh, that's a good thing. Can you or are you? How she asked it. I don't know. I was thinking about her booty the whole time. So I really wasn't um, there all the way. I never saw a booty so nice before after getting out of lockup. Oh. She smells so nice. You're like a summer warrior with that hair. Like Leave my fucking hair alone, man. I know I'm freaking like a sumo wrestler. Yeah, not a samurai. Very so, one thing I wanted to go over before I end this vlog. Uh, sorry I couldn't get Bubba in this one. Um, I guess she's working a lot, so that's probably her texting me now. Uh, it is one thing that caught my attention that I felt that it was best to talk about on a vlog randomly. Is a lot, a lot of you might know, some of you might not know, but I suffer from something called uh, BPD, which is an acronym for Borderline Personality Disorder. So I was diagnosed with it a couple years ago now. I go to therapy for it and, you know, yada, 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 take meds. Yeah, anyway, but I somewhat have it under control for the most part. But somebody had the weirdest argue, argument. Sorry, my hair looks crazy. I just got out of the shower. <laughs> but somebody felt the need to... I just want to make it uh, very clear that there isn't a very... There is a very uh, uh, negative outlook on mental health, and I never realized it until I was diagnosed. And it's like when my symptoms like arise, or I get, uh, or I you know it gets exacerbated. Somebody triggers me, so to speak. You know, it's like I get told things like, "Oh well." Your disease isn't is isn't an excuse. I'll say, well, I, I guess it's not an excuse, but when you have a disease that you know is your entire personality, you know, and you told the person what your triggers are, you know, it, it makes you question who's liable, who's at fault, you know, if you get triggered. Is it you or is the person that, you know, you're arguing with? And I lost a lot of friends, people I had to push out my life due to just pure ignorance. I think one person I even got into an argument with about what depression was. I said, well, you know, because I deal with major depression as well. 
Uh, it might not seem like it because I deal with it, but uh, he had it in his mind that depression is like a mood, like sad. Major depression is literally a clinical illness of your brain. They get the word depression from it being depressed. Neurons aren't firing like they should. Things are not connecting like they should. Uh, the stimuli that's around you is not stimulating you. It's like you're dead almost. And it's like, this is something I learned when in my early 20s. I'm 32 now. And for whatever reason, this is something that a lot of people don't know. A lot of people who are lucky enough never to have to deal with emotional or, or, uh, or mental illness. And at the same time, it's also dangerous because, let's say, you know, you're dealing with something and like, for example, I tried to get on Social Security, you know. They told me that my mental illness and everything I was dealing with wasn't good enough. Oh, okay. Because I also have physical injuries as well. It's not good enough for disability. Even though I worked for like over 12 years. So it, it just really blows my mind that my, I guess my, my point is people need to be more aware of what they're saying, who they're saying it to, and really do their homework before they speak to somebody who actually deals with what they're dealing with. Like, they actually deal with what you claim that you know. You're not going to know more about an illness than the person who's dealing with it. And knowing that I'll be a part of a, because my illness is actually very rare. Only 1% of the world actually has it. I like to sit here and say I'm like a Marvel superhero, you know, I'm a mutant. <laughs> but it's not funny though, because it sucks, you know. So my moods are like up and down, you know, throughout the entire day. And I do what I can to manage it, try to stay as productive as possible. And it's hard, but I deal with it. And knowing that I'm never going to have like a relationship with someone who's going to understand that kind of sucks. But, you know, it is what it is. But I don't know. Just wanted to sit there and get that off my chest. And end this vlog off with a lesson. I think people should be more aware of mental illness and what's out there because it is no joke whatsoever so like this video comment below mental awareness month day whatever and uh, let's give it a like and uh, keep being woke there we go keep being woke <laughs> you have a nice day <laughs>